Hi, I'm Dave Herbert and welcome to Mr. Herbert's science class. Today we're going to talk about tractors. Not this kind of a tractor that I used to cut my yard with, but something a little more nostalgic. Take a quick look at this. Today I thought that I'd show you my antique tractor calendar that I just received from my local Sanix dealer here in Sibley, Iowa. Let's take a look at this beautiful calendar that I just got. It's pretty neat. It's a 2008 calendar. And uh, this very first tractor we're looking at is a 1943 Farm All H. It had 25 horsepower and a four cylinder engine. A uh, beautiful machine. Next, we have this beautiful. 1955 Oliver Crawler. Uh, this had a 32 horsepower six-cylinder engine and was utilized to, for angle dozing, pothole digging, uh, backfilling, leveling, and snow plowing. Uh, pretty cool uh, machine. The 1941 John Deere LA. Uh, this had 13 horsepower, two-cylinder Hercules engine, and uh, was very strongly built, utilized a lot. And that is an Alice Chalmers that's all rusted on the right there, by the way. Next we have the 1950 Massey Harris Pony. Uh, this is a really cool looking tractor. It even looks like a little pony. And they were popular because uh, they were strong and uh, manufactured with small chores in mind. Pretty neat. Nineteen forty one case VC on the left and a nineteen forty nine case VAH on the right. Uh, the VC had fifteen horsepower and the VAH had 19 horsepower and they both had four cylinder engines. Very interesting uh, machines. Next here we have a John Deere lineup, 1934. Um, 34, 37, 47, and a 52 model. So uh, a nice, nice lineup there of John Deere tractors. Next we have this beautiful Massey Harris. Uh, this had 12 horsepower and uh, at the draw bar and 22 horsepower at the belt. And it had enclosed gearing and an unusual radiator that actually sat parallel to the frame. Pretty cool uh, looking machine. Next we have the 1940 Oliver. This was a num uh, number 70 row crop. It had a six cylinder engine with 26 straw bar horsepower and a six speed transmission and one reverse gear. Pretty, uh, pretty cool for the time. Next we have this beautiful 1946 Minneapolis Moline. And uh, this is quite a machine. It had a five speed transmission and was about 32 horsepower with a four cylinder engine. Very, uh, very good machine. Ah, here we go. A 1939 Alice Chalmers WC. A uh, beautiful piece of equipment. Uh, they made about 178,000 of these things between 1933 and 1948. It had a 30 horsepower four cylinder engine and a four speed tranny. A very nice piece of equipment. And next we have a 1957 Cockshut Golden Arrow. And uh, this was quite a machine from Cockshut Tractors. Uh, from uh, Ontario, Canada, and uh, it, it was quite uh, popular with the 33 horsepower four cylinder uh, gas engine. And last but not least, we have the 1948 
Farm All Cub. This was quite a very popular machine in those days and with only 10 horsepower and a four cylinder engine, three speed transmission, it was owned by almost everybody uh, because you could use it for mowers and plows and cultivators and a uh, great machine. So there you have it folks, that's the end of my calendar. Um, I hope you enjoyed the little tour down the tractor lane.